Fifteen people, five of them juveniles, are facing criminal charges tonight in St. Bernard Parish. Drugs, guns, carjacking, and possible involvement in a New Orleans murder. The list of charges is serious. WGNO's Anna McAllister is in Chalmette with the story. Anna. Susie Kurt, the sheriff's office tells me the suspects range in age from 13 to 20 years old. And Susie, as you mentioned, some of them are facing some serious charges. And meanwhile, residents say they are shocked to hear just how young some of the suspects are. The message is, is, is simple, that we're not going to put up with this stuff. What started as two arrests led to 13. The St. Bernard Parish Sheriff's Office taking five juveniles and eight adults into custody ranging in ages 13 to 20 years old. They're getting younger and younger. I don't understand if it's what it is. The sheriff's office originally arrested a man and a juvenile for resisting an officer by providing a false name and possession of marijuana. Through the investigation, they came across a music video on social media and identified the people in it as suspects of other crimes. Just because you in a video with a gun thinking it's all funny, we're not letting it go. We're going we're gonna to come after you. We're going to check you out. We're going to see if you have an illegal weapon. We're going to see if there's anything that we can charge you with. And if there's something we can charge you with, we're going to charge you. The suspects were wanted for carjacking and illegal possession of a weapon and narcotics. One of them is a person of interest in a New Orleans homicide. St. Bernard residents say they're shocked to hear just how young some of the suspects are. Scary. Very, very scary. Stop all this gun stuff, you know, it's crazy. A little nervous because that's why I moved over here from New Orleans to get away from it. Sheriff Pullman says it seems as if the suspects are getting younger and younger and says despite their age, they need to face consequences. The long term solutions is changing a lot of things to keep these little kids to be growing up to be these teenagers that we're dealing with today. But short term, you got to hold those guys accountable. Sheriff Pullman says that the investigation is ongoing and more arrests may be made. And he says in the meantime, his deputies are going to be aggressive when it comes to taking guns off of the streets. Kurt, Susie. Anna McAllister reporting live for us in Chalmette this evening. Thank you, Anna.